So captains, there's no doubt about it that airlines love to cram as many passengers as they possibly can into their cabins. The more flying passengers there are, the more money the airline makes. And an empty seat to an airline is like taking a piece of cake away from a kid. You just don't do it, you don't want to be in that position. But according to news reports, a private Chinese customer will shake things up in the game and they will implement a seating configuration which is unlike any other. Now firstly, Airbus haven't revealed who the customer is, but we do know they're from the Chinese region and they've ordered the A320. Whether it's the NEO or the CEO, that still remains to be seen, but Airbus are giving the opportunity to the airline to make the announcement themselves. So in terms of the seats themselves, well there are two versions, S1 and S2, and both of these versions can be used on any aircraft. The principle of the design is that the middle seat is set to be offset vertically as well as horizontally, which allows an additional 5 inches of room and pitch. Now the window and the aisle seats will be 18 inches wide, which is 1 inch wider than typical economy seats, whilst the middle seat will be increased to 23 inches. We know how annoying it can be when you're resting your arm on the armrest and it rubs with the passenger's arm next to you or the belly, well this is designed to tackle that so you're not aligned with the person next to you. They're also very light, weighing around 9kg, so this could prove to be great weight saving for the airline. Now the only issue that can arise is whether the airline can still fit as many seats as standard economy. They are slightly wider and the pitch is larger, and although they do offer comfort to a degree, it does mean that a few lost seats for the airline, but we'll see how that goes. Now the next version is S2, and these are essentially for long haul flights. They share the same design principle of being a wider middle seat. It has a more refined headrest where you can sleep in a more comfortable position and the seat also reclines a few inches more compared to the standard version. Also, the IFE is set to be slightly bigger, coming in around 15.6 inches, with the middle screen being even larger at 18.5 inches. How about that one guys? So overall I'm loving the design and it can really revolutionize the industry in terms of economy travel. We'll have slightly more legroom, more space and a wider IFE, but the question is, is whether the airlines will adopt this model for economy. To be honest, I think it's a great idea for premium economy more than standard, only because airlines might lose out more in economy depending on the size of the plane. But nevertheless, it's an innovation that's more than welcomed. Now captains, what do you think of this? Would you fly on their seats? What do you think of their design and do you think more airlines will be interested? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching guys, remember to like and subscribe as usual and I'll catch you guys very soon.